Now, if a patient has hypoxemic respiratory failure, we often give supplemental oxygen to improve their blood oxygenation. And even if this achieves a normal PaO2, the patient still has respiratory failure because they're requiring that supplemental oxygen. And so sometimes we quantify hypoxemia using the ratio of the partial pressure of oxygen in the arterial blood to the inspired oxygen concentration, which is expressed as a decimal. And in a healthy person, this ratio is between 300 and 500 millimeters of mercury. And we use it to assess patients with respiratory failure, and most notably it's used in the definition of ARDS, or Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome. So ARDS is a syndrome of hypoxemic respiratory failure caused by alveolar damage and the leakage of fluid across the alveolar capillary barrier. And the diagnosis of ARDS requires, in addition to other clinical parameters that we'll discuss, a ratio of PaO2 to FiO2 of less than or equal to 300 millimeters of mercury. And we use the ratio to define the severity of ARDS as well, with lower ratios being associated with more severe disease. And in general, you can actually use the PaO2 to FiO2 ratio to clinically monitor progression or improvements in oxygenation.